Hey guys, for this video we're going to replace the spindles for the deck on my riding lawnmower. This is a two pack of spindles by a company called B Seeds. And they were nice enough to send me these for free so I can make this video showing them to you. So we'll get these all installed here in one second. You can see the pattern or style for the blades it uses. It does come with a replacement bolt to go on your blades. You also get the four mounting bolts there. You can see the washer and nut up top and they are greasable. Comes with the greaser installed. We will have to add grease uh, before finishing things up. Don't forget to do that. So first thing we have to do is get the old ones out. Now my mower is a Craftsman, but this will be the same and these parts will work for several different mowers. So just make sure you're getting the right parts for what you have. First step for getting the deck off is putting it in the lowest position. Then what would be the left or driver side if you will. We're going to have a couple of pins here. And then we got one right there. And we're going to have the same two on the passenger side, right side. And the second one on this side. Now at the front we have another clip right here. And then get your belt off the drive pulley up front here. And we have to disconnect the blade engagement lever but we'll pull this thing out just a little bit to get better access. You can see the spring to it right here. Hooks on to this pulley here. First thing we want to do is take the plastic piece here out of the bracket. It's a little tab you squeeze where my hand's at on this side. And then push it through. Let it come out like so. And that'll make it easier to get this spring off. And it's just connected to the bracket up here. See? Just like so. Now we can just slide the deck out. And we are going to be changing our two spindles right here. Right there. Looks like I'm going to be replacing the belt while I'm here. Now you'll notice this pulley here is connected to this spring. That was your, where your engagement spring was. And these little pads act as a brake to stop these from spinning. All right, so that's a 7 8 nut right there. And we're going to run that screwdriver through there to hold everything. Now to make life a little easier, we're going to go ahead and take this spring off that's holding the brake mechanism. And now we got this guy out of the way. I have a little three-jaw puller on the pulley here. We're going to go ahead and tighten that down. Now we just got to do the same thing to the other side. Already have the nut off, we're just going to pull that pulley off. Looking at the underside of the deck, we got to get our blades off. For me, this is a 5 8 inch bolt. And one more time on this side. Back on the top side, we have four bolts around the perimeter. For me, these are half inch. And they break. <laughs> Good thing we got replacement bolts. Two for two. Four for four. Got the new spindle here and we're gonna grease it all up before we install it. It's gonna take a little grease. You're gonna be here pumping a minute.
See that grease starting to squirt out there? That means we're done. Now we'll bring this new spindle end from the bottom there. And it came with the four new bolts. We'll start putting those in. Now I'll tighten down these four bolts. Gonna put our pulley back on. This washer was threaded on there with this nut previously. Washer first, then pulley. Then nut. For now I just got the nut started. We're gonna flip it over, finish the other underside first. We're gonna put our blade back on. Remember the fin always swoops upwards towards the sky if this thing was standing upright. Up. Make sure you're inside your star here. And remember our new spindles come with a new bolt. Use a 5 8 on that as well. Now we're going to get some gloves or wrap a rag around this thing and hold it with one hand while we're tightening with the other. Now we're basically going to do the same thing to tighten that top nut. We're going to hold the bar in place and tighten from the other side. Finishing up the other side, have to take the old spindle out. Let's see if we can go 8 for 8 on these bolts. Eight for eight. Loctite works. Back at the bench so you know what time it is. That's right, time to get greasy. And that one's done. And now we can tighten these four guys down. Now we go washer. Pulley, nut, and we're going to flip it over. Got that spring hooked back up, and that wraps it up for us. Everything's tightened down, ready to go. I need a new belt, but all you do is put the belt on, slide it back under, put your deck back together. Now since your new spindles has these greasers in them, it's a good idea every spring to re-grease these to uh, prolong the life. There it is. Thanks for watching.